to know about the James Bill. Hope you're well, thanks for joining me. Well, the Bethnal Green's gone off. Uh, it looks really nice uh, in the light, kind of seeing it in its, uh, you know, obviously when gloss dries, once it's actually gone off, it um, has a much fuller kind of colour than it does when it's wet. So uh, yeah, it looks really good this morning. And my plan this afternoon or today is really just to carry on in the stern. There's quite a lot of uh, extra bits to do there with the, the uprights um, and some of the piping and the trimming to go around it. So that's what I've got to do. I'm unsure about the hinges. Um, I think a few people have commented that they like it. A few people have commented that they don't like them. Uh, I don't know. My only concern is that if they weren't there, it would just look a bit bland throughout the rest of the boat. The only thing I could do is keep the upper sill and the uh, little beam coming down. I could do those two in cream. Um, so yeah, I haven't quite worked it out yet. Uh, but as I said, I think it might look better when the livery is on. But for the moment, I think it's going to look a bit plain if there's nothing on it apart from the green. But yeah, I'm going to crack on with the stern. When I stripped this railing down, I knew where the weak points were. Basically, underneath it all was all chip paint, and that's because when it rains, obviously the drops end up on the underside of this of this rail, um, and obviously it's harder to paint there. So if there was a gap in the paint, that's where it kind of stemmed from. So I'm just making sure that I'm basically applying all the way around. It's a bit of a uh, neck saw because there's quite a lot of this stuff. Decided to put a line down the middle of the hatch which does make it look better I think and obviously if I painted it half decently instead of the way I have done it it would look a lot better so I'll do the same on the other side but now the uh, stern areas had its trim done there's loads of drips it's, it's done so badly 
but it's first coat. Basically, what I think I need to do is go over the whole thing in cream, like slap loads of cream on it all the way around and then go over it again with the green because the brush has a natural ridge there and it'll get it all nicely. And there's welds and stuff, it's all a bit ugly, but as long as I can get a half decent line, and then I think I'll do the same on the inside trim as well. Well, as you can see, I have put a line down the centre of the hatch, and I think it's made a big difference. Um, I was kind of not sure about the hinges. Obviously, I've painted them really badly. Um, what I need to do is paint the weld the same colour um, and the whole hinge. So basically, the steel, you know, anything raised above the steel basically gets painted. Same with this. So um, I need to basically mask it all off and do it properly with a thin brush, not the massive one I've got. So um, I'm going back to London today. Uh, actually, I'm going to Southampton to see Karen again. Um, but then after that, I'll be in London for most of the week and I'll equip myself with the um, correct tools and I will come back and do it. Same with like, the world above here. So. I've just got to make a point on each one and just mask it off and basically just whack the cream on it there. But now I've done the rails, they're, they're much smoother. Now they've had kind of two coats of gloss. I'm, I'm just gonna be kind of constantly up, there, up, up doing these rails, I can imagine, because um, they're gonna get worn and torn and dirty and stuff. So yeah, I'll, uh, I'll be constantly doing that. But the more paint on them the better but they're certainly kind of coming to life a bit more as is the stern it's looking good i'm going to do the same thing on the door in the um in the stern i think that might make a difference um and there's got to have to be some kind of instrument cluster uh, or panel uh, in that big wall space so that will change it and then the gas locker will have a cushion so that will kind of make it look a bit better at the moment it looks a little bit bland still but yeah i'm really happy with the color i've had loads of like nice comments and stuff so um, yeah it's good so I'll leave it for a couple of days I don't know when I'll be back might be Wednesday or the, uh, who knows so um, but until then hope you guys are all very well look after yourselves bye bye okay so what looks better ignore the horrific paint job but no line in the middle or yes line in the middle <laughs>